What is up guys, Joe here back with another video. Today I wanted to cover the Chihuahua token on the Cosmos blockchain. So Chihuahua is the official meme token for the Cosmos network. And they have a ton of support from all the validators and developers of the Cosmos ecosystem. So we all know the success of Dogecoin and Shiba Inu that just skyrocketed and blew up in price value. And the Chihuahua token has a high chance of becoming the next successful meme token. So today I wanted to cover some history behind the Chihuahua token, how to buy it, and finally how to stake it. There's a big roadmap ahead for the Chihuahua token, and it makes sense to start buying the token now at a very low price. And lastly, I wanted to cover a step-by-step -step complete guide on how to buy the Chihuahua token and earn staking rewards. So let's get started. So this is their homepage, chihuahua.com. WTF and it's being billed as the official Cosmos meme coin. Chihuahua is the first interoperable meme coin with POS blockchain, making it one of the most utilized chains in the Cosmos ecosystem. Proof of stake blockchain. Chihuahua is a blockchain built using the Cosmos SDK and Tendermint consensus. Hua Hua is a native staking and governance asset of the Chihuahua chain. The estimated yearly consumption of the Chihuahua blockchain is less than the energy consumed by a Dogecoin and Ethereum in a single day. Interoperable with over 30 Cosmos chains due to the IBC protocol which allows transferring Hua Hua assets to the other chains in a matter of seconds. Governance Chihuahua has a built-in on-chain governance system. Holders of the Hua Hua, the native staking token of the chain, can vote on proposals on a one-to-one -one per token vote basis. APR. Delegating Hua Hua to one of the 100 validators in the active set increases the security of the Chihuahua network. Also gives staking rewards up to 400% per year. And you're also able to yield farm the Chihuahua token with other pairs within Osmosis. And here are some of the recommended validators for delegating when you're ready to begin staking. And here are some stats regarding the community. Currently more than 14,000 members on Twitter, approximately 3,000 users on Telegram, over 1,500 on Discord, and roughly 1,000 members on Reddit. So the main area you'll find all the information regarding the Chihuahua token is on their Twitter page. And on here you have the general info webpage, you have some of the community channels, and also lastly how to delegate and stake your Chihuahua tokens. And also there's this very handy website comparing Chihuahua to some of the other meme tokens and this is memecoin.wtf and on here you see the main stats comparing Chihuahua to Dogecoin and Shiba Inu. So Chihuahua has a price of 0.0044016. Comparatively, Dogecoin is at 14 cents right now and Shiba Inu is 000.225. But I think the most important statistic here is market cap. So Chihuahua comes in at only 440 million. Dogecoin has a market cap of 19 billion and Shiba Inu has a market cap of 12 billion. So roughly, if you do the math here, you do see that Chihuahua comparatively is very undervalued. We're still under 500 million market cap while these other two players are over $10 billion each. So if you run the numbers, there's high potential for Chihuahua here. It can easily 10X from its current price point. And you have a chart here layout comparing the two and they tend to move in conjunction with each other. So here's a seven day of Chihuahua versus Doge versus Shiba. You can even look at the one year Chihuahua. Keep in mind Chihuahua was just launched a few weeks ago at the end of 2021. Here's Doge which has been in existence for a couple of years. And here's Shiba, which has been in existence for over a year. And again, some quick comparison, comparing to three, the main difference here is you can actually stake the Chihuahua token at over 400% APR. So if you click on this buy button here, it will take you to the Osmosis Dex webpage. And from here, you can swap Osmo or Atom for Chihuahua token. And we'll get there in just a minute. So let's go ahead and look back to our guide. The first step would be to install 
the Kepler wallet. The URL here is Kepler.app and on here you would simply click on install Kepler for Chrome and Kepler is the official Cosmos wallet for the Cosmos ecosystem and Kepler is very similar to MetaMask. You would install it on Brave or Chrome. You would add the toolbar here and the shortcut for the wallet would populate in your toolbar on the top right. Click on the K and on here you have the various chains available to you. So once that is installed you're going to want to buy some Atom from Coinbase and send it to the Kepler wallet. So I'm a big fan of Coinbase Pro being that they have lower fees than the normal Coinbase. If you're going to be buying coins constantly the way to go is definitely Coinbase Pro but to send the tokens is exactly the same way within Coinbase. All you would do is navigate to the Atom page. You would hit on send and receive and under send select the amount of Atom you want to send and under two where you would paste the Kepler Cosmos address. So you would go to your wallet up here, verify you're on the Cosmos hub, the Cosmos wallet, and your address is right below your username here. So copy and paste this address into this field here. So back to Coinbase Pro, let's go ahead and withdraw and select the Atom asset, crypto address. Now under the two section, same idea, back to Kepler, we're on the Cosmos hub, copy the wallet address here and paste it here. We do not need a memo for this transaction, so check this on. This transaction does not require an add a memo. For amount, I'm gonna go ahead and send one. And there is an associated gas fee with this withdrawal. So a gas fee is simply just a network fee in order for your coin to get from point A to point B. And this is inherent in all blockchains. All blockchains have gas fees inherent in their protocol. And verify this is correct. We're gonna hit withdrawal. Now it's gonna ask me to verify via my Google Authenticator app on my iPhone. Withdrawal has started. So now you're gonna have to wait a few seconds. Great, so our Atom balance just updated. We do have 1.31 available. Amazing. So the next step would be to connect to the Hua Hua chain to Kepler wallet on the OmniFlex website. So this way you can add the Chihuahua chain to your Kepler wallet. So the website here would be chihuahua.omniflex.co and on here all you would do is hit connect. And you do get a prompt asking for a chain ad request and it's asking to add the Chihuahua blockchain to Kepler and we're going to go ahead and hit approve and one more time hit approve. Great, and right away I do see that I have over 2,000 Chihuahua tokens available to me for free. The reason I see this is I've been staking Atom tokens for a couple of months now, so all Atom stakers were eligible for this free airdrop. So once I connected my wallet here, my free airdrop tokens appear. So to anyone who's been previously staking Atom, you might want to check this website as well and see if you were eligible for the free airdrop. And if you notice also, so once you navigate to the Kepler wallet, at the very bottom, we do see the Chihuahua chain has been added. So our next step would be to connect the Kepler wallet to the Osmosis website. So the website here is app.osmosis.zone and simply you would navigate to the bottom left here, hit on connect wallet and select Kepler wallet and right away instantaneous connection. And the home page here is the trade page, also known as the swap page. So our next step would be to load Atom under the Assets tab. Back to the website, let's go ahead and click on the Assets tab and locate the Cosmos Hub Atom token and we would hit deposit and you're gonna wanna select the amount to deposit. So we're gonna go ahead and select one and go ahead and hit deposit and right away you do get this gas fee window and this is again just your transaction window you have the option of doing low average or high so that would be slow medium and fastest the low here would cost you four cents while average would be 10 and high would be 16. i always recommend going with the low setting if you're going to be continuously staking and yield farming these small fees add up so why not save some money along the way go ahead and click on low approve so i do have a ledger now device synced with my Kepler wallet and this is just an extra layer of security I like to take for confirming transactions within Cosmos. The Ledger Nano device is not necessary for you to be staking or yield farming but again it is an option for you to have that extra layer of security. We can hit next. Transaction was successful and if we refresh the web page here we do see that our atom loaded into the web page we do have one whole atom available to us now. Our next step would be to swap the Atom token for Chihuahua under the trade tab. Let's navigate to trade 
and it defaults to Atom. So what do we want to trade it for? Chihuahua. So let's navigate and find the Chihuahua token. There it is. Amazing. And let's just go ahead and click on max since we only have one atom available. So the exchange rate here is roughly one atom would equate 6,997 Chihuahua. So almost 7,000 tokens, which is amazing. So just picture Chihuahua hitting one cent one day. That's a huge potential. If you do the math here and you multiply the numbers, that would be a huge gain. So this looks like an awesome trade. And just a reminder, there is an associated swap fee. So anytime you swap tokens, the fee here is 0.3%. Gonna confirm the swap, hit swap. One more time, our gas window, we're gonna hit low. Prove. Great, the transaction was successful and if you go back to the assets page and you refresh the page and we scroll lower, we do see that we have our 6,976 Chihuahua available. So our next step would be to withdraw the Chihuahua from the assets tab. That way it can move from the osmosis page back to our Kepler wallet. So back here under assets, let's find Chihuahua and all we're simply gonna do is hit withdrawal gonna request a connection to the Kepler wallet approve and we're gonna hit max let's go ahead and pull all of our tokens we just acquired withdrawal gas window we're gonna hit low approve next great the withdrawal was successful and if we refresh the web page here we do see now we have a zero balance of Chihuahua on here but if we navigate to our Kepler wallet and we open our Chihuahua chain we do see we have over 9,000 available so our next step would be to navigate to the Omniflix stake page and the web page again here would be chihuahua.omniflix.co and hit on the staking tab or very simply under the Kepler wallet. Now that you've added the Chihuahua chain, you would just click the purple stake button here. And as you can see, earn up to 468% APR. Let's hit stake here takes you to the same location. And from here, we're gonna to have to pick a validator to stake with. So very simply, there's a few criteria when choosing a validator. A, do not choose a centralized exchange or the top 10. That means anyone like Coinbase or Kraken or Binance or any of these bigger players, they usually do not redistribute free airdrops to you. So if you're eligible for an airdrop, they like to keep them for themselves. This is why we don't recommend you choose a top 10. You want to choose an independent validator who's going to keep the network decentralized and will redistribute the airdrop rewards to you. B would be do not choose 100% commission validator. So the minimum commission rate is 5%. Someone who is at 100% commission rate means they're oversubscribed. They're not accepting new members. And lastly, you want to research who the validator is. Are they a true validator? Do they have a good track record how does their website look presentable legitimate all of these things matter so back to the staking page and we can sort by voting power you click here and it's from descending order so the top most hold over a billion chihuahua tokens and as you scroll lower we have 900 million 600 million 500 400 200 the list goes on so like i mentioned we want to avoid the top 10 so let's scroll lower and find an independent one and here we have citadel one i know that's a popular one they have over 200 million stake of chihuahua tokens and only a five percent commission rate so that's a great commission rate so let's go ahead and pick them hit delegate the validator is correct so the one and tokens to delegate we can hit max but keep in mind you do need to leave a couple of chihuahua tokens behind just for gas fees so we're gonna go ahead and just choose 9,000 and choose delegate here's our gas window and let's go ahead and hit low and we're going to approve success we've delegated successfully our 9000 chihuahua tokens done and if we navigate back to the dashboard page this is our home page we see that we have 9000 staked chihuahua tokens and pending rewards of 0 0.02 chihuahua and our validator is here citadel one so keep in mind rewards are paid out daily after every successful epoch completion so it's roughly every couple of minutes you get staking rewards paid out to you but because it's so minimal i wouldn't recommend you check every minute for your rewards you check once a day that's enough and you can actually come back into here your validator page and delegate your rewards back into the same delegator so in order to keep your rewards compounding so that is the final step of your chihuahua staking journey you have to decide what you want to do with the rewards 
You can either restake them daily with the same validator or you can convert them to another coin. So like I mentioned, it's good to diversify your validator. So you would go back to stake and pick a different validator to delegate your rewards with. Or if you want to convert them to another coin, you would simply go back to Osmosis into assets again and load whatever asset you want first into the deposit button here and then into trade and from here you can swap your chihuahua token into any other token you would like say adam or osmo some of the newer ones like akash or the crow token and the cool thing here is you can even stake the crow token within the kepler wallet or you could send it into the crypto.com app and cash out so here you would simply go to kepler and navigate to the chronos chain crypto.org and from here you can stake under the purple stake button or like i mentioned if you're on the crypto.com app you would grab your wallet address there and pull this out from osmosis and send it to crypto.com and also you can yield farm the chihuahua token on the pools tab here within osmosis and you can pair it with another coin to earn even higher apr rates for example we have the chihuahua osmo pair and this would net you 166 percent apr on this pool you can even do adam and chihuahua and that would net you 135 percent apr so there's a ton of ways you can continue growing your capital assets within chihuahua and the cosmos ecosystem and if you want an in-depth analysis on how to yield farm within osmosis do have a separate video i've created on how to yield farm in this ecosystem i'll leave a link on the top right so i know we covered a lot today how to buy chihuahua token and how to stake it and i do recommend you stay up with their twitter page to get all the latest info on their product roadmap and chihuahua has also announced they are distributing free airdrops for chihuahua stakers so this is another incentive for you to continue staking the chihuahua token just for being part of the network so i'm super bullish on this coin they have a ton of potential ahead of them and they're the official meme token for the cosmos blockchain so as long as cosmos continues growing so will the chihuahua token so let me know what you think about chihuahua are you a fan do you think chihuahua could be the next dogecoin or shiba inu let me know in the comment section so i hope you found this information helpful if you have any questions please leave a question in the comment section i'll be happy to respond don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.